Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching this song tutorial video. In the first part, I'm going to count out the song's chords so you'll know exactly how long to play each one. In the second part, I'm going to play through the entire song so you can practice along with me. So stick around to the end, and if you find this video helpful, please like, comment, subscribe, etc. Before we begin, you should click on that link at the top of the description, and that'll take you to a chord chart containing all the chords and lyrics of the song you're about to practice. I recommend printing it out right now and grabbing a pencil so you can write in the number of beats per chord as I call them out to you. If you see a chord you don't recognize and just click on link number two in the video's description and that'll take you to a list of chord tutorial videos. Finally, if you want to learn more songs once this video is over, click on link number three and that'll take you to a spreadsheet containing all of my chord charts and song tutorial videos. Now let's get started. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to play Go Tell It on the Mountain. Let's begin by going over the chorus, which sounds like this. Go tell it on the mountain doing um, kind of a syncopated uh, strum pattern, so my downs are longer than my ups, like down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, and um, so I'm going to go down, down, ghost, up, down, up, down, down, ghost, up, down, up, and by ghost I mean I'm strumming downward just to keep that motion, just to keep the rhythm going, but I'm not actually touching the strings on the ghost, so down, down, ghost, up. Now let's count those chords in the chorus. Uh, that first F is going to be for eight beats. Go tell it on the five, six, seven, eight. Then C7 for four, three, four. F for two, C for two. Next line is F for uh, four, D minor for four, F for two, C7 for two, F for four, two, three, all right, now the verses. Uh, let's go over verse one. And verse one sounds like this. While shepherds kept their watching for silent flocks by night, behold throughout the heavens there shone a holy light. All right, so in this we have um, that first F is going to be two beats. I'll play this a little slower. While shepherd, C for two, F over watching for four. Then the C7 is going to be for two, D minor for one, C for one, F for four, two, three, four. Behold, throughout um, is going to be like another um, two beat F. Behold, C for two, and then the F over heavens for four. G over shown is going to be 2, G7 over holy is going to be 2, and then the C7 over light is going to be 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. All right, so hopefully you got all that. And of course, what applies to verse 1 in terms of chords and chord timing will apply to the other verses as well. So I'm going to play through this song, and you can practice along with me. So if you think you're going to have trouble keeping up with my tempo, not a problem. Just click on the little gear-shaped icon at the bottom of the screen, and that'll take you to the playback settings menu where you can adjust the playback speed to 0.75x or any slower speed that you desire. So um, I'm going to go um, verse 1, verse 2, verse 3, just one after another, slowly, and then go through the chorus one time. All right, and I'll begin by just strumming an F. So, F, verse 1. While shepherds kept their watching For silent flocks by night Behold, throughout the heavens There shone a holy light the shepherds feared and trembled 
Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to click on link number three and check out my other chord charts and song tutorials. If you want to help me make more videos, you can support me on Patreon using the link below. God bless, and I look forward to seeing you next time.